welcome to the Temple of Consciousness. Please come in. You are attending a yoga lesson that's available from my Patreon site. I'll provide a link below. I want you to experience the class first, and then if you like the experience, then please consider becoming a member of my yoga family. I teach yoga on Siesta Key Beach and have done so for um, 16 years. And I've taught yoga since I was a, a young girl. <laughs> and I've maintained my practice and my teaching throughout the years. And I feel that yoga has given me uh, my vitality, my health. I've maintained my flexibility and I have remained pain-free all the years that I've lived. And I attribute it absolutely to yoga. So in this series, I just ask you to come along with me and experience a class. I'll be verbally instructing and physically demonstrating. I want you to do what you can and participate at the level that you feel comfortable at. So let's begin. We sit in easy pose with our legs folded in front of us, just above the ankle. The hands rest on the knees and the back is flat. I want you to parallel your shoulders, flatten them out. Relax them. Relax your arms. Relax your legs. Relax your whole body. Close your eyes. You're going to breathe abdominally, deeply, opening up the abdominal muscles as we inhale. We expand out. We inhale deeply. We open up. Exhale and feel the air moving out from the nostrils as you draw the abdominal wall in. Pull it in and contract into your navel, identifying the center of your body. Collapse into the navel. Exhale. Inhale, open up. We expand our body out. We inhale. Feel your body moving out away from you. Feel your mass expanding out, away from you. Exhale, pull it into you, directly towards your navel. Drive it towards the navel and pull in, collapse. Tighten the buttocks, pull the shoulders down. Keep the back flat. Relax your legs. Inhale, open up wide. Exhale, pull in. Inhale, open up. Exhale, holding on to the knees. We lean back slightly and we bring the knees slightly up. We put the hands at the front of the knees and we walk the feet out. Putting the feet together, sole to sole, directly in front of you in line with your tailbone. I want you to lay your hands on your knees and gently let your hands press onto the knees. We keep the back flat, shoulders plumb, parallel. We breathe abdominally. Deep breath, inhale, bring the elbows out. Open up the abdominal wall. Press into the feet. Exhale. Bring the elbows down, draw the abdominal ball in, and press the feet together, sole to sole. Inhale, we open up the abdominal wall, we bring the elbows out. Deep breath. 
Exhale, we bring it back in, pressing into the feet, back flat, shoulders pulling down, elbows come down, draw the abdominal wall in. Inhale, release, elbows up. Now we feel an energy spiraling up through the spine as we open up the front of the body. Exhale, we bring the elbows down, we bring the shoulders down, we draw the abdominal wall in and we press into the feet. Exhale, back flat. Inhale, lift up, feel it. Press the knees down, bring the elbows up, chest high. Exhale, slide your hands down your legs. Hold on just below the calf, wrap the hands around that area, adjust, press into the feet, exhale, relax your hip sockets, keep the back flat, keep the energy moving up through the spine, deep breath, inhale, bend the elbows out, exhale, pressing into the feet, keeping the knees down, bring the chest forward just slightly, using your arms like levers, we inhale, press the knees down, press into the feet, Exhale, bring your elbows down onto the knees and press the knees down with your elbows. Press into the feet and draw the abdominal wall in. Exhale. Feel it. Press down. Push into the feet. Breathe. Abdominal. And feel it. Pressing down. Pressing down. At your full weight, fall. Pushing down into the knees. Pressing into the feet. Chest pulls straight up. We breathe. Breathing abdominally. Feeling that area underneath your abdominal wall and filling it with your abdominal muscles. We open up. Inhale. Exhale, we draw the abdominal wall in, we press into the feet, we push the knees down. Inhale, we open up the abdominal muscles. Exhale, we press, we push into the feet, elbows down, draw the abdominal wall in. Exhale. Inhale, slide your hands down a little bit further, pull back, the arms straighten. Press into the feet and pull the feet in to you. Release the hip sockets and let the knees drop down. Keep the back flat, chest right over the hips. Inhale, we pull back and we drop the head back. Knees down. Feel it through the shoulders, through your neck. Let go of your neck. Chin up. Look up. Press into the feet. Use the feet as your anchor. Keep Tension through the arms. Keep the knees pressing down. Chin up. We sigh. Releasing your stress through a deep exhalation through the mouth when needed. Like that. Like that. Face forward. Bend the elbows out. Deep breath. Open up the abdominal muscles. Exhale, pull the feet gently to you, an inch or two. Bring the chest right over the hips and bring the elbows out. Press into the feet. Exhale, draw the abdominal wall in. Exhale. We put the hands right over the ankles or near the ankles. We keep the chest right over the hips. We lean back, bend, and pull back. We separate the heels, pointing the toes in. We lift one foot up off the ground and pull that leg away from us. We pull out. We pull out. We pull out. We pull out. And we bring the leg up. We 
wrap the hand firmly around the ankle and we drop the leg down away from us. He flex the foot and we press out through the sole of the foot. He face forward. The other arm and leg is used as your anchor. We can even flex the foot of the foot that's on the ground. We press out. We press out, sending the energy out from the hip socket all the way through the leg, out through the sole of the foot. We lean away from the leg, and the leg pulls away from us. Tighten the knee. We hold and breathe. Feel it. Lean back. Press the leg away from you. Pull it away from you. Flex the foot. Swing the leg out a little further to the side if possible, keeping the back of the leg facing downward. We swing it out. Swing out as far as you can comfortably. Pull it out. Feeling it on the inner thigh, feeling it on the hamstring, pressing it out through the sole of the foot. We swing it out. We swing it out. If possible, hold it out as far as you can comfortably, pressing the energy out from the sole of your foot. Face out. Breathe. We swing the leg back, letting the weight of the leg fall away from us. We counteract that by leaning away from the leg. Then we turn the leg in and we bend the knee. And we put the down, foot back, sole to sole. Lay your hands over the ankles or just above and then bring the elbows out and bring the weight of the torso back over your hips, shoulders down. We adjust the feet, we bend the elbows. We gently, gently push the knees down. We inhale, we roll the shoulders up. We lift them up high. Pull the chest up, press into the feet. Press the feet down. Lift the shoulders up. Roll back, roll the shoulders down. Pulling the shoulders down, pressing into the feet. We draw the abdominal wall. In. Feel it. Feel it. Exhale. Press down. Press down. Press the legs down. Knees down. Keep the shoulders down. Keep your back flat. Press into the feet. Hold and breathe. Press down. Sigh if you need. Release your tension. Press down. Press down. Inhale. Lean back, pressing into the feet. We push the feet forward. We readjust the hands and we release the other leg, the other foot off the ground. We lift up. We pull back. And when you feel you have control, then gently start to Straighten the leg up. Gently, 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 gently. The back of the leg faces forward, and you pull back the torso, creating tension through the arm. That side of the body circulates energy. Feel it. You lean back. The other leg, the bent leg, and the other arm are used as support, as your anchor. We sigh. We stretch, flex the foot, adjust, swing the leg out if you can, adjust, pull out. We hold and breathe, we slow and deep, breathe abdominal, swing the leg out, press it away from you, feel the energy through that side of your body as it circulates. We sigh. Pull out. 
we then release very slowly, we swing the leg back, we bend the knee, we put the feet down sole to sole, we connect the feet together, we realign them, we place the hands right underneath the calves, above the ankles, we then pull the feet directly in to us, as close as we can get, as close as we can get. We keep the shoulders pulled down, we release and let the legs drop to the earth. We bring the arms behind us. Use them as two rod supports behind you. Press down through the arms and press the legs down. We push into the arms. We lift up through the crown of the head and we press the legs down. We bring the arms behind us and we lift the legs up just a little. We take a deep breath, keep the soles of your feet together. Lift the crown of the head up, use the arms behind you to help elevate the weight of the torso. Inhale up. Exhale, we drop the legs down, we bring the elbows in closer behind us, we press into the arms, we lift the crown of the head up, knees down, draw the abdominal wall in. Inhale, bring the knees up. Exhale, down. Inhale, bring your legs, your knees up. We turn the feet flat down, side by side, and we bring the legs in together, directly in front of us, pressing the legs into each other, keeping the arms, let me show you. Just let me turn for a moment. All right. So we want to keep the legs directly in front of us. Keep the heels in as close as you can. Keep adjusting and press the legs in to each other. Lift the crown of the head up. Press there. Belly, chest touches the legs. We sit down. We press the feet flat down. We lift the crown of the head up, feeling the energy zigzagging through your body, pressing into the legs, chest high, deep breath. Exhale, bring the knees down, turn the feet together. Keep the chest high, walk your hands in closer behind you, keeping the chest high. We press the knees down, we bring one hand forward and we put it on the inside of the knee and we bring the other hand forward and we put it on the inside of the knee. We turn the hands in so that the fingers lay inward over the inner knee and then we lean forward and we press the knees down. Chest lifts up, face forward, push into the knees, press down. We sigh, releasing the tension. Let it go. Press into the feet, chest out. We turn the hands over. We wrap them around the knees. We then place them underneath the knees and we lift up. We bring the knees up directly in front of us and we wrap our arms around the knees. Let me show you. Pull in. We pull the legs in with our arms traveling the arms down the legs and pulling in, we bow our head down. We pull in, we bow our head down. We let go of our back, we let go of our spine and we release the tension from the spine. Let me show you. We open up, head down, chin in, turn your chin in and lift the feet right off the ground, pulling the legs into you. Shoulders down, we pull in, we pull in, we compress, we pull in, we sigh, press down, we release very, very gently, letting go of your shoulders, face forward, Pull the legs forward, pulling the shoulders and the area between the shoulder blades 
open for you. Let go of the center of your back and allow your spine to relax. We're opening up the vertebra. Imagine a straight line exiting from the center of your back. We pull along that line. We bow the head down and pull out. The toes are pointed. The heels are up. The legs are together and pressing into each other. The legs are pulling forward as the center of your back pulls to the back, head down. We release. We let go. Pull your legs to you, hug them, flex the feet, pull the shoulders down. Press in. Inhale, pull back out and release your legs from you. We then put the feet down, the legs are folded in front of you. So now we lace the fingers together in front of the knees and we begin to become conscious again of the movement of energy through the body. So allow the energy to transfer through the legs. We press the legs into each other, knees together, feet flat, press the feet flat down. Press, feel your connection to the floor underneath you. We ground ourselves. We press the feet down, splay the toes, and push the soles of your feet down. Flatten your back. Press in. Inhale. We press the belly forward. We roll the shoulders up. We inhale. We roll up. We roll back, and we lean back away from the legs. And we just hold here. We're going to now do a series of movements and pose is where we hold the pose that will strengthen our center, our core, our power source at the solar plexus, at the abdominal wall. So let's lean back and lift the feet right off the ground. Bring the elbows out, face forward, and flatten your back. We hold and breathe. Feel it. You can put your feet down anytime and rest, and then rejoin us. We're going to build core strength. We take a deep breath. Open up the abdominal wall. Keep the back flat. Exhale, pull your legs into you. Bring your chest and belly forward. Bring the feet down. Pull the legs directly into you. Keep the shoulders down. Pull in, bow your head down. Pull the legs in as close to you as you can. Flex your feet. Pull, exhale. Inhale. Press the legs out away from you, hands right at the knees. We pull out. We pull back. Feet off the ground, feet pointed. Pull back. And now exhale, bring it in. Flex the feet. Press the legs into you, head down, shoulders down. Pull in. Press the legs into each other. Press the plate. <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> Press the plate of your hip forward. Shoulders down. Head down. Inhale out. Exhale in. Inhale out. Exhale in. And now release. Place your hands behind you and extend the legs out away from you. Bring the shoulders back. Bring the knees into you using the arms as a support behind you now. We pull in and out. Exhale in. Inhale out. We move. We build strength. 
with the breath. Now we speed it up just a bit, and as we do, we puff out through the nose, releasing puffs of air. Slow down. Bring the legs in, put the feet down, bring your chest forward, and let me face you. We readjust, place the feet down flat to support you right in front of your hip sockets. Put your hands right above the ankles, wrapping the hands around your legs for support. We then sigh. We walk the feet out, we bring the arms to our side, we lift up and we sit down, we walk the feet out and we lift up, sit down. Let me make sure you can see what I'm doing. I would like you to put your body into this shape, this right angle, maybe I'll turn sideways so you can see a little bit better. So the legs are extended out away from us on the ground resting on the ground, the hands are on the knees. Let's take a deep breath now, open up the abdominals. Press the legs down. Flex the feet and point the feet to you. Lift the heels right up, tighten the kneecaps and pull them up towards you. Keep the back flat and smooth out the shoulders, relax them, keep the chest wide open. Press out. We bring the arms now to our side. We use them to align the spine, to keep it straight. We lift the weight of the body up. We sit down, we bring the arms out, and we bring the arms to the back, and we swing the arms in and out just to provide a little flexibility for the shoulder sockets. We just move. We swing the arms, and we move back and forth at the hip socket, just to give us the opportunity to release some stress and tension from the hip sockets and the shoulders. So then we settle in and we lay the back of the legs flat down onto the floor, pressing it down, point the feet to you. Keep the chest wide open, inhale, we extend the arms, we lift them up, we lift them up, and we pull them out straight. We pull out. Thumbs to us. Extend the empty out from the soles of your feet. Pull out. Keep the chest wide open. Inhale. Rotate to one side. Along the waistline. We turn. We inhale. And then we exhale. And we pull out. Chest high. Hold and breathe. We twist. We twist. We reach out, we reach out, we turn, keep the chest high, feel the energy. We inhale, we turn a little more, we face forward and we turn the front hand to the side with the palm facing out sideways, the back arm, palm faces upward. And then we begin to feel this energy pulling through the front arm. The arm becomes like a rope pulling you. We lean forward to one side, to the opposite side of the arm. We pull out. We extend. We roll the back shoulder back and pull that back arm back. And we extend out. We come down, belly first, and then we extend out. We pull out, we pull out, and we come down. We come down. 
palms turn, front palm turns down, back palm turns up. We extend the front hand down. We bring the back hand down. Then we pull through the arms and we lay down. We sigh, pressing the legs into the earth, adjusting and pulling the arms away from the center, opening up the shoulders, opening up the shoulder blades, pressing the torso down. We hold and breathe. We extend. Press down. Breathe slow and deep. Keep the pressure. Extending through the arms. Press down. Sigh. Press down. Deep breath. Inhale. Point the toes. Press the back of the legs down. Use the legs for security. Push them in to the floor and then begin to lift the weight of your body up, sliding up. We bring the arms out sideways as we use the arms as a support to the shoulders. We press into the arms and we lift the shoulders up. We lift the weight of the body up off the ground and we roll the feet. Keep your eyes closed and roll the tension away from you. Through this rotation, we create a release valve. So we let it go. We release it now. Keep the weight of your body suspended between the arms. Keep the weight off of the hip sockets as you roll. We sigh. We release and then we roll in the opposite direction. Keep the back flat. Keep the energy moving up through the spine. We roll it out. Chest is nice and high. We then release the tension and we let go. We soften the arms. We soften the shoulders. We lay the legs down on the ground. We press out through the heels. We Flex the feet and press out through the heels. Extend the arms out. We inhale. We lift the arms up. We extend out. Pull out. Pull out. Lift up high. Just send the energy up through you. And then rotate along the waistline to the other side. Extend. We then lean down and we pull through the front arm as we pull back through the back arm. We turn and we extend. We extend. We fall. Keep the energy moving through the arms. Keep the legs pressing down onto the floor. Extend the energy through the arm. The front arm. Turn the front palm down, turn the back palm up, bring the hand down and lay down. Put that hand down behind you, then extend. Press down. We press down. We hold and breathe. And turn the back shoulder to the back, pull back and pull through the front arm. Front hand, extend it out, roll it back, press down, hold and breathe. We pull through the back arm to help lift us up. We point the feet 
and we gently pull the weight of the body back up. Bring the front arm around the legs. Use them as a support again. Bend your knees and walk your feet in very carefully. Relaxing the shoulders, we walk in and we lay the legs down one over the other right in front of us. Feet fold. We come to the side of the hip and we face straight out. We take a deep breath. We inhale. We roll our shoulders up. We roll them back. We inhale. We roll them up. We roll them back. We inhale up. We lie. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale. Place your hand around the feet. Feet fold over each other. We adjust and turn onto that round exterior bone on the side of the hip. We then extend the arm out directly in line with the hip socket and we lean over, hold onto the feet and then pull the feet into you, press them into you and lean down onto the side of the body, press in. Press, feel the stretch running from the hip socket all the way up into the shoulder. Close your eyes and stretch. Feel the length. Feel. And press. We sigh. Push the feet away from you and use them as a counterbalance. As you push into the supporting arm out on the side, we return our weight right over the, that single round exterior bone on the side of your hip. The legs remain folded. You can use them as a support. Hold on to them. Keep the chest face forward. Inhale. Bring that arm out and wrap it around your head. Then bring the other hand up, pull the hands together, lace the fingers together like this, and then draw the arm around the head and point the elbow up. Press the legs into each other, chest down. Feel the length. Stretch. Feel the whole. And bring the arms behind you if you can. Press the head back and come down. Come down. Elbows back. We hold and breathe. Face forward and gently bring your weight back up, supporting it over that round exterior bone on the side of the hip. We bring the arms over the head. We adjust. Elbow up. Elbow up. Stretch. We hold and breathe. We hold and Let go, bring the upper arm straight up and then float it down sideways. Once it reaches the ground, lean into it, bringing your weight again over that round exterior bone on the side of your hip. The legs remain over each other as you swing them forward. Bring the other arm out, keeping the legs together as if they're magnetically attached. We inhale. Pull the legs in, we put the feet down flat, we swing the hip over to the other side, 
and we fold the legs down. We turn the chest forward, we keep the legs folded over each other, and we get comfortable. Put the hands over the toes, over the uh, feet, adjust, balancing. Extend the arm straight out from the hip and lean into it. And then lift the feet up and pull the feet to you. We stretch. We stretch. Stretch. Press. Feel it. Sigh. Stretching the sides of our body. Press the legs into each other. Keep the feet up high and in. Fold it into you. Stretch. Stretch. Feel it. Then use your hands on the feet to help guide your weight back up. Pressing into the exterior arm. We come right back up, we let go, we adjust, we release our tension, we sigh. Put your hand back over the leg just to give you support and face the chest forward. Inhale, we extend that arm, the free arm out, and we lift it up. And we wrap it over the head. And we point the elbow up. Press the legs into each other. Stretch. Stretch. Breathe. Feel your breathing. Slow it down. And then release the other hand. Bring it up. We hook the hands together. And we let the lower arm dominate and pull down. Elbow up. Right over the head. We stretch. Put the arms behind you and then press your head against the arm. Tilt over, tilt over, tilt over. If possible, we stretch. We stretch. We stretch. Holding on, we pull right back up, we inhale, we release, and gently the arms extend out, letting go of your shoulders as the arms float down. We release the tension through a deep rotation through the shoulders. Inhale up. Exhale, bring your arms behind you and Lift the legs up as a unit and extend the legs out. We bring the hips back and now the legs are open and folded on the ground. So let's adjust and walk the feet out. Bring the hips forward, slide your hands down to your ankles and lay the arms on the shins and rest the weight of your body forward. We lean forward and we walk the feet up. We lean forward and we extend. We let go of our shoulders. If you want to stay up here, just releasing and opening up the inner thigh, you may do so. But advance as you feel you can. Flex your feet. Press into the heels. Press the arms against your shins. Pull forward through the hip. We flex. 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 Lean forward through the hip, through the chest. Lean forward. Press. We hold on to the 
then we begin to move. We let the feet point and flex, balancing on the heels, resting the arms on the shins, releasing the tension from the hip sockets, from the lower back. We let it go there. And we walk up and down, up and down, just letting go of our lower back. Releasing it now. Then we walk the feet out and we press the feet down flat. We keep the arms on the legs. We bring the torso forward. We open the chest, chin out. We then slide the hands down to the ankles and we push the feet forward. We straighten the arms, chest out, press the feet down. Bend the elbows out, face forward, and pull directly from the sternum. Press into the feet, chest out. We bend forward, pulling out, holding in. Extending, feel it, open up your lower back, the inner thigh, the hip socket. We flex the feet and bring the legs all the way down to the earth. We press the back of the legs down. We support ourselves through the arms, through the legs, pressing down. We then push the legs out a little further out, if possible. We press down, face out. We sigh. Flex your feet. Let me make sure you can see. We're going to twist from here, if you'd like to try. We lean forward. We bring one shoulder down and the other shoulder up, and we turn. Keeping the arms straight, we adjust, pushing into the legs, through the arms. We push them further out as we gently come down, pressing them. Twisting, pushing down, flex, we hold and breathe, sigh, come down, push out, hold and breathe, hold for as long as you can comfortably. We swing the head up and follow its momentum up, lifting the shoulders up and pressing down into the back of the legs, using them as your counterbalance, your support, as you lift the torso up. We slide the hands up the legs and we plant the hands down just outside of shoulder width, directly behind us. We lean back and we roll the legs in and out. At the hip sockets, we roll in and out. We sigh, we let go of the tension. We open it up, in and out, in and out. We sigh, release your tension. Roll in and out, let it go. Let it go. We now plant the back of the legs firmly down onto the earth. We flex the feet, we keep the back flat, we open up the chest wide. We lay the hands underneath the knees. We take a deep breath now. Exhale, we slide down. We slide down. Lean out. Press through the arms. Push the legs out. We pull out from the sternum. Press the back of the legs down. Point the feet to you. 
pushing into the arms. You reach out. You hold them really tight. Stretch. Stretch. You turn the other shoulder down and really pull. Press the back of the legs down, push into the arms, twist and pull. We turn, we twist the spine, we stretch the hamstrings, we compress the knees down, we twist at the waist, we hold a loop. Press. Sigh. Hold a loop. Inhale, swing the head up. We slide the hands up the legs. We point the feet. We lay the hands underneath the knees. We lean back and we walk one leg in about an inch. And then we walk the other leg in about an inch. And we walk in incrementally to the center, keeping the hands underneath the knees. We then roll from one side of the hip over to the other. And we adjust the legs, pressing the legs down hands underneath the knees, point the toes to you, lift the chest up and pull back. You release, heels up off the ground. Let me show you if you can see this and come back. Heels up, pull back, press, pull back, pull back. Drop your head back, letting go of your shoulders and of your neck, you pull back. Bend the elbows out, keep the chest nice and high, take a deep breath, inhale, abdominal. Exhale, pressing the legs down, bending the elbows, we fold over the legs, we compress down, belly down, chest down, shoulders down, head down, press the knees down, bring the shoulders down. Exhale, press the legs into each other, and pull through the crown of the head, pressing down. Exhale. Inhale, pressing down onto the hands. We gently tilt up from the hip socket. We bring the torso up, and then we drop the head back. Heels up, off the ground. Press the legs into each other, and then bending the elbows, we fold forward. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up, exhale down. Inhale up, we hold, lift the heels up. We drop the head back and we pull the energy up from the feet through the body, driving it up through the spine and tilting the head back. We pour energy out. From the crown of the head. We hold a loop. Face forward, bend the elbows, point the toes, press the legs into each other, put the hands over the knees, keep the legs pressing down onto the floor and into each other, slide your hands down over the legs, over the feet, hold the feet, flex the feet, put the hands over the toes, press the toes down, pull the feet to you, Lift the heels right up off the ground. Turn the tailbone to the back. Bring the elbows out and pull your chest down. Press the legs in. We stretch. We hold them really tight. We pull it out. We pull it out. We pull it out. 
Hold and breathe. Stretch. Stretch. Feel it at the lower back. Feel it through the hamstrings, through the feet, the toes. Extend. Lay the torso down onto the legs. Press the legs down underneath you and keep the energy moving through you. Chin up. Pull up. Extend. Breathing into your legs, abdominal. We extend the arms now, laying them on to the feet. We use the feet as a support, like a shelf. We lay the arms onto the toes and we let go of the lower back. We sigh. And then we begin to walk the arms a little further forward, one at a time. We extend. We extend. We extend and we walk out. We extend through that side of the body. We're stretching that side of the body. As we pull out, we then adjust. Press the back of your legs down. Adjust the arms. Make sure that they find equal support. Bring your head down between the arms. Press the knees down and pull out from the fingertips and the crown of your head, and point the, the thumbs back. We hold and breathe. Sigh. Sink down. We rest. We hold. Breathing abdominally. Breathe into your legs. Sigh. Turn the palms down, open up the fingers, face forward, and pull your torso back. Then put the hands over the toes, pause for a moment, press the legs down, pull the feet to you, and push the plate of your hip forward. Bring the shoulders down, lift the heels right off the ground, pull back, lean back, lean back, back flat, pulling back. Stay here and breathe. Reach back, feel it, keep the energy moving through you. Then point the toes, release it, point the, guide the hands back over the knees, underneath the knees, we bend one knee, we bend the other. Using the hands as the support, we walk the feet in and we fold the legs again. We fold the legs again. And we're back to where we began. I want you to sit for a moment with your legs folded and release whatever tension you may have accumulated. We release the shoulders, we let them go. We let go of the hip sockets, release the knees. Holding on to the knees, we inhale. We roll the shoulders up high. We roll them back. We exhale. We roll them down. We pull the abdominal muscles in. We exhale. Inhale. We open it up as if your body were a balloon. Expand it out as you inhale, feeling our mass moving out away from us. We inhale deeply. Exhale. We pull that energy back into us. We concentrate it towards the navel. We pull in. Shoulders plumb, pulling down. Tighten the buttocks. Exhale. 
Inhale, release and open up wide. Exhale, fully. Deep breath, open up. Hold your breath. Exhale, bring your hands to prayer. We bow our head. We take a moment to express our deep gratitude for life in silent prayer. Inhaling, we turn our head upwards towards heaven sending gratitude to heaven. And exhaling, we bow down to the earth, sending gratitude. And inhaling up, we turn to one another and we send one another our gratitude. We bow and we say namaste. And so, Thank you for attending the second of the series uh, on the Patreon uh, Yoga Studio. So thank you, and I will see you next time. Namaste.